What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Coral Reef Talk. Today, we're talking skunk clownfish. The skunk clownfish gets its name because it has a white stripe that goes from the nose all the way across the dorsal to the tail fin. Now there are many different kinds of skunk clownfish and one of them being the pink skunk clown. And the pink skunk has the white stripe behind the eyes as well as the white stripe across the dorsal. And there's also the orange skunk clown which are the clowns that are in my tank and the orange skunks only have the white stripe from the nose to the tail. Now the two in my tank are a mated pair and they host in three bubble tip anemones that surround them. They tend to stay in their area and they only dart out of the anemones for food or to make room for eggs or to take care of the eggs that have already been laid. Now of course like all clowns the larger of the two is the female and the male will defend and take care of the eggs. These two have been spawning in my tank for a few months now and unfortunately I do not have a breeding tank set up so once the eggs are dispersed into the water column, they are eaten by other tank mates. If you're looking for a different type of clown, I would definitely suggest the skunk clownfish. They are a peaceful fish. They eat a variety of food from frozen to flake food. They love to host in anemones and they tend to keep to themselves. They can be a little shy, but if given an anemone to love on, they will be just fine. Now the skunk clownfish is also one of the smallest types of clownfish so you can keep this in like a small nano tank all the way up to a large aquarium like I have behind me. Okay guys that'll do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. Thank you for all of your support. We're up over 2,500 subscribers now. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram, check out the website thecoralreeftalk.com. Remember to like, comment down below if you have any questions. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time on the Coral Reef Talk.